Here's the one I'm taking down this morning. She's actually very tiny, a little female. And we believe she already had a litter of kittens underneath someone's place. I'm going to cover her up, by the way. I always cover up the cats. If you don't want to hear them crying, she may still cry. Some of, Most of them don't. But she's already had a kitten, a litter of kittens, her first litter. And they all died underneath somebody's place. And then I saw it. Uh, I never got to see her. I just heard about it. So about a week ago, I saw her outside and the male cats, which was the one that I just took down and got fixed. Uh, he hadn't got fixed yet. Had his appointment coming up. And I, he was trying to get her. And actually, he was getting her. So I brought her inside. I got her because um, she's half friendly. And then I brought her inside. And she was still in heat. I don't like taking the cats down when they're in heat. Uh, the doctors are okay with it because they know how to t handle the cats that are in heat. But, you know, I just don't like doing that. So, anyway, um make sure she don't have no more kittens a lot of times the cats their first litter of kittens they don't know how to handle them and nobody told me about that about it till it was too late they said they heard kittens crying for about a week underneath someone's house over here it was really I said why didn't you tell me you know but yeah oh we just want to let nature take its course and I'm I was a little upset about it but you know you can't control people what they do so I'm just trying to make it right now by getting her fixed so she don't have to worry about having any more kittens out here. And it's going to help in a lot of ways. So now I'm on my way to Humane Society. Cutting out for now, bye.